We've got some really exciting news for our boat club members. We've recently got Sunna MCA coded, which means we can open up our area of operation as far down as Swanage, Studland Bay, Pool and surrounding areas. Available from the start of July, those members that have access to Sunna will need to go through some additional training to unlock this new area and go exploring. All you need to do is give us a call and we can get you booked in and out towards Swanage as soon as possible. Last week, Jake, Max and I took Sonar on a maiden voyage to the new extended area to demonstrate where you can go in the future. Firstly, we headed from Boat Club to Swanage Bay. The travel time was approximately two hours in good conditions. And when you arrive, you're in for a treat. Swanage has so much to offer, especially on a sunny day, it can feel like you're in the south of France. Next, we headed northeast along the coast to the stunning Studland Bay with a truly unique view of Old Harry's Rocks. There's so much to see from the boat around this area, including old war battlements and of course, Old Harry itself. Don't forget your paddle boards. Pool was our next stop with some fabulous views of sandbanks as you cross over the chain ferry entrance. A bit further down the channel, you can moor up and take a walk around and treat yourself to an ice cream or perhaps a beer. One of the most popular anchorages on the south coast of England, Studland Bay is in the southwest of Pool Bay, just outside Pool Harbour. Finally, we headed back via Bournemouth Beach, home to the famous Bournemouth Air Show, where you can anchor up and watch the magnificent aerial displays. Heading back past the Needles and Yarmouth, we find ourselves back in the zone and arriving home at Trafalgar Wharf. We can't wait for you to explore these incredible destinations on the South Coast. For more information, please get in touch with one of the team today. We look forward to seeing you again soon.